Hey guys, welcome back to my house under construction. This is my upstairs family room, and I love wood ceilings. They give so much character to the house, but this wood ceiling has a bit of a surprise in it. That's right, I've got a hidden staircase. Check this out. Hidden in the wood, this real staircase is way different than the junky staircases. You know, most of the time when you think of attic stairs, you think about that string and those rickety fold out wooden or metal stairs that are garbage. Not this one, this is a metal staircase with a real handrail. There's a guardrail at the top and this actually is at a 45 degree angle so it's comfortable to walk on. But not only that, we've totally concealed it in the ceiling with this wood Windsor One shiplap we've got going. Today's build show, Hidden Attic Stairs. Let's get going. Aren't these things awesome? Now I've got with me Steve from Magic Stairs. Hey Steve, Matt, how's it going? Good man, you and your crew did an amazing job. These guys actually came all the way from Florida to put these stairs in for me. Very cool process. Will you walk me through this install, Steve? So basically when you contacted us and you gave us the specs for this uh, stair, we built them in the factory. We're actually in, based in Ocala, Florida. They're okay. built right here in the United States. Uh, and they come mostly assembled. Um, we crated that guy up and we put it on the truck and we took it off the truck here. So to install these, we basically have uh, some, what we call our hanging bars, mm -hmm. which attach to your floor joists or trusses. Yep. And the stairs more or less hang on those. We have safety railing around the attic that our motor hangs on and that's really what does like all this. the heavy lifting. And we have two bolts that fasten that in, that hold it in place. And then we have our lifting cable in a and a bolt and a couple of pins at the bottom here. Yeah, the, sta the safety rail I think is a big deal. And these safety rails too mean that when I go up and down these stairs, I'm not worried about falling. Plus I've got a standard 45 degree normal staircase, not the rickety one uh, that's the standard one. And then we've got a final finished plywood face that's gonna go on this thing. But other than that, you're pretty much done at this point, right? We're, we're very close, yes. Yeah. Now, I'm gonna be doing some hidden door work on this, but before we get into that part, Steve, tell me about the backstory on this staircase. I, I think I've heard from you that it was actually a builder that invented this product, right? Yes, that's right. Ron, our inventor, moved from Denver, Colorado. He came to Florida with a bunch of boxes and nowhere to put them because we don't have basements. <laughs> so Ron invented some stairs because he didn't want to use that rickety ladder, and he got his boxes off the garage floor the neighbors wanted to do the same, and before you know it, he's in business. How about that? That is so cool. Now, if someone watching this wants a set of these stairs, first off, give me some range of cost. Can you give me an sure. idea what these run? So we make seven residential sizes, and what determines the size is the height of your ceiling. Okay. This is a 14 tread unit. Mm -hmm. We start at 12. The stairs start around $3,000, and that would be plus shipping and installation. Okay. We do ship them all over the United States and Canada. Mm -hmm. If you have a contractor that you can work with or a handyman, most, most people are, are capable of putting these in. Anywhere in Florida we have dealers and we are looking to expand if someone's interested in becoming a dealer who has a construction background, we would love to talk to them outside. Yeah, so if you're a builder or a homeowner watching this, you know, you could get a set of these shipped to your job site from, you know, really anywhere in the U.S. or, or North America that you wanted them. But if you're watching this and you're interested in actually becoming a dealer, they're looking for additional dealer opportunities. Absolutely. We'll have a link to the website below for you guys to get any of that info. But let's stop the video here. The next thing I've got to do is figure out how to make this attic stair disappear with my ceiling. So we'll pick it up next. All right, my friends, I got to say, it's really hard for me not to laugh when I put these stairs down and I show them to people. And everybody who sees them, of course, thinks it's cool that they're hidden. But the staircase itself is, is totally mind-blowing. I mean, it's so different from those rickety attic stairs with that string that you're used to seeing. To have a real metal staircase with a handrail that feels solid. Now my attic, which in my house is all air conditioned space, is really usable. I can actually have storage space up there. Such a fun project. Now I do want to mention one last thing. We had to spend a little bit of time on this panel right here. You see that little panel? Uh, it's a little hard to tell, but there's a slit in the woods here and then there's about a quarter inch gap right here. That panel is so we can take that down if we ever needed to 
uh, interact with the staircase in manual mode. If for, if for some reason the motor went out or the power went out, we can take that panel down. There's a couple C-clips in there, uh, or not C-clips, they're uh, cotter pins basically. We can pull those and then the staircase would drop down on its own weight. So it's kind of an emergency setting. It was difficult to get all the details worked out, but I had a great carpentry crew. Uh, Carlos and Toke did an amazing job on this. It really was pretty straightforward. I think that you could do this on one of your jobs as well. And of course, if you didn't do this and you just made this a standard attic access, that would work as well. You could put some uh, casing around that. You've got a nice plywood face on that door. And if this is in your garage, you of course wouldn't have to go maybe to those lengths. But what an amazing staircase. I'll put a link to those guys in the description below. And all the shiplap that we use, it was Windsor One that I use in the rest of my house. I'll link to those guys too. If you're not currently a subscriber, guys, hit that subscribe button below. We've got new content here every Tuesday and every Friday. And by the way, if you're new to my channel, I've got a lot of hidden door content. I'll also have a playlist in the description below to all my hidden door videos. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Otherwise, we'll see you next time on The Build Show. Hey guys, before we go, one last cool thing to show you. Check this out. This is the Magic Attic Lift. This little device would be perfect for taking your holiday decorations, your golf clubs, you know, whatever up in the attic. Now we're in the garage of a house under construction. We just installed this and we actually have a fantastic attic space above. And this attic actually is gonna be conditioned, which would be my preference for an attic, of course. But you could use this anywhere. 150 pound max, it uses pretty much the same motor as the stairs. Very cool little setup. And then when it comes up there, it's gonna nestle right on top of the drywall. This one might be a little bit harder to conceal than the staircase, but I think you could still conceal it if you wanted to. Anyways, big thanks to my friends at the Magic Stair Company. Check them out, link in the description. We'll see you soon.